Where's our mallet? Oh, there it is. Where did we put the... You know, if we had a mobile French cleat thing, I'd have a place to put this stuff. So here's what we're doing. Mm -hmm. Here's the, the mobile wall. This is what we're gonna work on today. You might recognize this project if you follow Steve Ramsey of Woodworking for Mere Mortals. Finally. I know, right? <laughs> um, yeah. I, I, I can't concentrate. <laughs> Roofers. Um, that is so much noise. <laughs> Let's get cutting. <laughs> It is definitely Monday. This is when the projects go horribly wrong, by the way. <laughs> oh, cruel. I know. Ah! Yes. Okay, cool. Let's start cutting dados and at least putting part of it together. What's the difference between a dado and a rabbit? Dados in the middle, rabbits on the end. Let's set up a dado. Mm. Once I find out what I do with them. <laughs> oh, here they are. Raise it up to three eighths of an inch. Let's go with a three eighths of an inch dado mm -hmm. because it's going to be holding a lot of weight. You're doing that, like what, two of those left to do? Yeah. It should take about six hours. <laughs> Not the prettiest dados I've hand cut, but they'll do. I'm done, you done? I'm done. Let's dry fit this so we can cut the drawers. So this goes here. Look at this. Get the... I actually took notes. The front pieces of the tray, I thought we would make three inches, because then we can spray them with chalkboard paint and actually write what's on the tray. Okay, need nine more of those. I'm gonna get started working on the drawers. All right, two down, eight to go. I nailed it to the table. <laughs> There's just certain things you just don't want to show people, and this might be one of them. Just kidding. So let's put some door slides on, and then we put the tower together. Glue in all the dados. We're gonna get the pieces and put them in. And then we're gonna put glue on top of those pieces and then we're gonna sandwich it all together. I really hope this is the smart way to do this. What do you mean the smart way to do this? Oh, look at that. Wow. Okay. Let's put this on the bottom. And everything's lining up. French cleats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four. So Type Bond 3 has a holding power of 4,000 pounds per square inch. All that's left are the uh, dividers on the other side and put the drawers in. We can just slide it to the edge and then tilt it slowly over. I want to touch it for strength. Hop up. Okay. All that's left are these pieces. I kind of have an idea on how we can do this. I'm tiny enough, I can do it. Okay. I have an 
idea. It is upside down. Okay. All right, ready. Should we open the door and get? I like, probably should open the yeah, door. Yeah, but. There we go. Hard remembering. Wow. Oh. Ready? I'm ready. All right. All right. Let's spray some polyurethane. Yeah. Oh.